I welcome in this video. This video is also made for English language learners. In this video, I will tell about the online graphical dictionary and the title of that dictionary is Visuers. If you like this video, share it and subscribe my YouTube channel for new videos and stay tuned. Online graphical dictionary and it is used as also thesaurus or as lexicon. Visuals becomes right now it's very popular online graphical dictionary and to know about that it becomes very important. What is visuals and how it is important we have to find that. Visuals is online graphical dictionary. It's production in mind my passion. My friends, if you look at visuals, whatever it is in the wish words you define the information which is used in the issues it is used in a mind map fashion and the relationship of words shown by different colors as you start to use wish words you will come to know that how the different colors or different patterns different shades of colors are used to know the words and your categories as either it is a synonym or antonyms or it is a homonym or any other category of that particular words whether it is a noun verb or etc these different colors of shades are used to know the words of a particular dictionary and so it uses the different colors the mind map is interactive. It allows to pan, zoom, click or drag for explanation. It is very important. If you start using issuers, what do you find? There is a mind map which is interactive. Interactive in the sense that it is very, uh, what do you may call that? It is very uh, movable and whatever is used in that dictionary, we can zoom it, we can pan it, we can double click we can drag somewhere and that is very important as you start to use it you will understand how issuers becomes very important available as a free resource to all users of the web it is another very important point of that issuers is a free resource to all users of the web whatever users are there as you start use issue issuers you will find you do not have paid anything else it is a free available we can use it it uses princeton university word net that is very important to know about the issuers useful to whom it is useful who can use that that is very important question those who are researchers scientists teachers and students and scholars all of these people can use uh, issuers in their uh, research and in their field the, uh, the thing is that it is available in English language but it is very important and a very necessary tool to know about that hello friends this is a wish words as you enter wish words in a Google as you ta uh, start to search it what you will find you will find that there are so many things we have to learn from that as you click the wish words you will find what you will get it it opens in the google as if your internet is active whenever you are online online it is available online it is not available offline it is very important to note that as you start to search it visuals.com the such a kind of interface uh, you do find visual dictionary visual thesaurus interactive <coughs> lexicon we have to click on explore as you start to be explore what you find such a kind of interface uh, comes out look at this interface this is a search box you have to put some words here is a menu what you have to do in the menu is there uh, you will you will find that uh, here if you look at the uh, uh, left hand corner what do you find this is a 
and different colors are look at the purple green and yellow pink these are colors and these colors are used to know the category of the words like whether it is a noun verb adjectives adverb or etc these are the colors you have to find there are different shades of the color and this shades you have to find a different uh, shapes are there look at linear are there you look at this such kind of shapes are there and all these colors are uh, used for uh, something uh, important uh, information uh, regarding to the word look at these colors are there if you do find look at this if you look at this uh, red color uh, it stands for opposite if the word has either it is opposite or uh, not uh, another point here i if you look at this uh, this uh, era you will find uh, this is uh, in, uh, look at the dictionary uh, you can do that whenever you you can drag it look at this i am dragging it is very movable one you can dra drag wherever you want uh, look at this uh, this is very important it look at, it is very Uh, movable one and we do find it is uh, in the shape of a globe it is a very a uh, uh, circle shape you do find and different nodes are there different bubbles are there uh, we can do find and different uh, words are there look at the word like a shark whenever you put such a word you will here in this box whatever word you may put uh, you will find for example a abandon i have to put the word abandon look at this uh, word uh, abandon i have to put it as you start to search out it uh, you will do find uh, different uh, uh, words are comes out in that uh, look at the uh, different colors are uh, look at the words are there uh, look at the words are uh, different automatic these are the some words are there uh, already there so you do find uh, that as you you can move that wherever you want it will look at the move how it is very really amazing and interesting one we can move wherever you want uh, here is a word look at this very uh, important uh, to know about that if you look at these bubbles are there uh, and as you click a particular word you do find that you look at if you look at this uh, shade is there you will find that shade for example if you go there it is opposite Uh, so this shows the some opposite word is there as you click it uh, what you will find you will get a definition of that for example look at the words there emitting or reflecting very little light etc or example is there and this color is that it means uh, the uh, the dull word shows the antonym of a what bright this is and that is the center nod you will find it is opposite to the uh, dull so different colors and shades are there uh is similar to look at this this uh, linear uh, dots uh, line is similar to what the words are there different uh, words are there which are uh, near to the meaning semantically so we can understand the relationship of these and these nodes are look at these nodes are there so look at the shape of the dictionary it is very important so we can use this uh, you can use this dictionary for your research or whatever work it may be either to write a research paper or write any article or uh, we can uh, do any thesis or etc whatever it may be we can use this dictionary and uh, anybody can use it as i told earlier that you can uh, the scientists can use the scholar can use a researchers can use student even learners teacher all of them can use the dictionary and that is very important dictionary i do find there are so many alternative alternatives are available on uh, internet but i do find that is the best and so in this video i try to uh, give a little bit information